Good morning. Welcome to today's devotional, which is titled Sun Exposure. Psalms 119 verse 105 says, Your word is a lamp for my feet and a light on my path. While the mountain type required may vary, all plants require sun exposure to grow. Light energy is essential to creating the sugars and starches that sustain the plant. Even on the cloudiest of days, a few minutes of sunlight peeking through is better than if the plant were placed in a dark corner. The same can be said about spending time in God's Word each day. Of course, schedules are full. Life circumstances create cloudy conditions. We enter into seasons when we want to give up. And eventually, we find ourselves in a dark corner, thanking for whatever reason that this is good as life gets. Oh, our visions adjust to this darkness, but we never really clearly see clearly. And sometimes we don't see God's truth at all. We need light. We need His light. No wonder standing in the dark each day we find our spirits getting depleted and needing to be fed. Your choice of spiritual nourishment may differ significantly from the next person's choice. And that is fine. Getting the nourishment is what matters. You may spend an hour with him each morning before the sun comes up or at night before you crawl into bed. You, o- you may open the Bible and pray during five-minute intervals or throughout the day. You may only have time to read a single verse now and ponder it later. And in some seasons of life, you should definitely count ten minutes of solitude with him as a victory because it is. Even a few minutes with the Almighty God, with your Good Shepherd, and His Word will provide nourishment for your spirit. As you find yourself hunger for more, know that He will gladly provide. For now, for today, for this moment, make the commitment to spend time with God each day. However this happens isn't as important as making it happen. We can't grow spiritually if we don't grow, if we don't go to the food source that God provided. Our spirits are starving and can only be satisfied by Him. Besides, a few minutes of sunlight peeking through life's clouds is better than spending a day in the dark. Lord, forgive me for the days, the times when I prefer darkness to your light. Forgive me for the times I think I've got this. And thank you for moments like this one, moments in your light when I recognize that I need both you and your word to guide me, feed me, and lead me. Amen, and God bless.